Hey everybody, welcome back to Backpack Hero. I'm gonna start a new run here. Um, let's start with a rare item, let's see what we get. Paladin Sword. Deals 10 damage, gets anchored for two combats. I'm gonna stick with this sword. This run, I would really like to try a magic build. I mean, we'll take what we can get, obviously. But I would really like to do magic if we can. Because I've not done magic yet. First couple battles all go the same. I do want to try an archery build, but they just seem really terrible. Um, okay. Let's do these. So, we did get a wand. That's perfect. So, we got a cleansing wand. Not actually that great. <laughs> Um, that one we'll leave. We'll take the mana stone still, because I want to do magic. We'll take a seasoning. We take the poison. Um, let's see... How do I fit this? I'd like it to be in a top space. Which I don't think there's a way to do. Mm, then we want to do this, and... Mm, no, we're just going to have to miss out on the armor for now. Unless, you know what, I don't think I'll be using the seasoning. Let's do this to get the bonus. Oh no, hold on. Neither of these give bonus armor. Jason clothing. Okay. Okay. Well, we'll go with that for now. Two locked doors here. That sucks. Since I don't think we're going to get uh, enough keys for that. But, first couple combats should be a bit of a breeze, as per usual. And I will try my damnedest to make a, uh, a magic run work. Ugh. I do like thorns. The problem is that thorns setups suck against poison. Um... And the only reason I haven't gone for a full Thorns build yet with no other things, just go as many Thorns as possible, is because running into a bat or running into a snake is an instant loss for the run because I have no way to kill them other than Scratch. And I will just die to the poison. Um, so... Okay. We go all out and we can kill. We get another level up. Let's grab here so we have all across the bottom and here. Um, and then grab these. What do we have? Okay. Um, we're going magic, so let's go structure. Or rather, we want to go magic, so let's go structure. Put that there. Move this over. We have... Uh, two more items we can take. Probably we'll grab a Lucky. We'll probably grab a Magical Herb because that's a lot. Um, and do we just grab a Ring or maybe we just take a... Oh no, we're, we're out. Okay. Yeah, 
I'm happy with that. Um, they don't have enough money. I'll take out the slime first. Hmm. Do I want to take a hit of damage with the spear? Now we're going magic run. Let's go magic. get damage through his armor right there anyways, so. 13, however. Okay. So. Hmm. In the meantime... Uh, okay, let's move some things around. First off, we want this mana stone. Um, and we need the shield for now as well. Uh, until we can start one turn killing enemies, we need the shield. Um... Spikes aren't going to be useful. The Peridot isn't useful. The only thing is that it's a rare, so it can sell for a decent chunk. Just get rid of the helmet. Not, uh, I don't want it next to a weapon. Hold on. Um, I mostly just want it there so I can sell it. Sitting at 8, we can sell this probably for 5, so 13 gold. These I don't want. Okay, let's do these and then we'll hit up the store. Okay, we have to go all out on the B. And not be having curses. Even if it's a curse of honey, I just don't. Yeah, that's the one thing I gotta... I gotta double up on the shields, uh, so can't deal any damage. Potted plant is interesting. Um... Not interesting enough, though. Only have to use one here. Still not enough to deal damage, though. So, we have an electric wand. Seven damage for one mana. So, now we are going to move things around. I don't have any way to generate more mana other than the magical herb. That's my main issue here. So I don't quite want to get rid of this yet. We'll do that. Let's see how this goes. We'll go here first. Okay, key is important. Buy seasoning. Um, I like the boots, but not enough. Okay, you have my first wand. Adds one regen. Uh, we do have another structure and another magical herb. First off, let's sell this. We don't care about that. So we're at 15. Um, how much is the brick? Six. Magical herb is also six. Uh, that's six. We can get two items. Two cheap items. Let's grab the brick. I think we just grab the brick. <clears throat> I don't think uh, we grab anything else. 
Do we open one of these or no? Eh, what the hell. You live and you learn. Another key. Okay. Um, do we want this heart ring? Nah, I kind of like where we're at. I don't think I have enough mana or a way to generate enough mana for it, me to be able to fully swap over to wand. Okay. So there's our magic. There we go. Get a little bit of damage on him. You get our level up. Perfect. Uh, we do get a my first wand. These are conductive, so it'll go through. So if I want, I can add regen. We have another mana stone. Um. Oh. Oh shit. These regen after every combat. Oh. That makes so much more sense. Okay, let's do this. Okay, that's way cooler. I thought you needed something, like an item that recharges these. Um... That's insane. Okay. Um, do we grab the shiv? Nah, we don't have any synergies for the shiv. Um, anything else we might need a key for? Let's just move on for now. Uh, 16 I need. That's fantastic. Uh, we can only deal 21, which is enough. Uh, another brick. Goodbye. Um, do that. Structures and magic. Um, this is our first event room. Oh, yes. Okay. When a weapon kills an enemy, add three haste. Expert bow. Okay. Okay. I would not mind getting the ruby here. Okay. Oh, we have to. Nice, we got it. It was here, right? That's insane, guys. That's really good. Okay. So, bye-bye shield. Um, so, this is now giving us two block. Um... um See, I wanted to touch the mana stones because it's conductive and this holds on to mana. We just do this. So this is giving us two, three, two, two. So that's four, uh, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve armor per turn. These are conductive. Uh, so that's three, four, five, six. That works. And this... 
puts this damage up at 11, 6 times 11, so 66 damage per turn, or per, uh, per combat. Um, is there a better way I can uh, organize this? Let's see. What if I put these here? This here, this here. Um, that just becomes 1, 3, 2, 1. That is worse, yeah. Um, but can go like this. Um, that can go there because it's conductive. Uh, we'll do something like this for now. I don't need the shield anymore because we're getting enough armor from these. Hopefully. Uh, I am going to do these combats because I want to level. Okay, let's see. <gasps> ah, shit! I didn't move the ruby up. Uh, we'll do that. Okay, you know what? Let's go back to our old layout. Old layout was better. Um, cleansing bomb? Maybe just a dart? Some extra damage if I need it. Let's do this last combat. Ooh, okay. So, we'll go for the one dealing damage first. That's crazy. That is so nice. We'll do that uh, for more brick stuff, and we'll do that to get another adjacency with the wand if we need it, and here for more brick stuff. Okay, we didn't get more bricks, but we did get a My First Wand. Which we might as well put here for now. Um, for whatever reason, if we want the regen instead. I don't think we will, but... Uh, we'll grab another magical herb. Since one magical herb will refill our magic slots completely, which will be good for some boss fights coming up. Um, I don't mind the cleansing potion for some poison shenanigans when we get to the magma core. Okay, what do you have? Um, nothing. Well, not nothing, but nothing I want. I want to hold on to a key because I know here in our boss room, last time there was an optional door. Um... Yeah, so I want to go through this optional door and see what's there. Okay. Uh, we got a queen bee for our boss. Okay. Well, that's magic. What do we have? Um, all consumables get rage. Um, uh... When an adjacent item is present, this item gets disabled. All weapons have that new. No. Uh, and the shield thing. Um, I guess we just take the consumable boost. Um, Let 
like that. Because these are consumables, so they'll give us rage. I guess. I don't know if rage affects our magic damage. I would assume it does. Oh my god, that's lucky. Ah. Uh, the haste from that's very interesting. <clears throat> I'm not confident that we will get away with... Oh, man, because this is going to be doing 15 damage now. And it's going to be 8 casts of 15. Which is a lot. I don't know if it's enough to clear everything, though. Because the Angelic Armor, the two haste, is very nice. I think I like this, though. And let's go ahead and open. And let's check out whatever this is. I wonder if this goes to the deep caves or if this is a side area. Another enchanted swamp. It's a new area. Okay. What do we have here? A lot of damage. Um, let's kill you first. We have enough casts here. Guys, magic seems really strong, huh? There's another structure. We have a honeysuckle. Um, hmm. I know that the old log can be good um, if we're doing like a spice setup, but we're not doing a spice setup, so... Kind of like this, though. Because uh, this will give us three rage and boost up our wand. I still want to go for all combats here. Ooh, you had spikes. I don't like that. Um, I should be able to take them all out. I guess that for now. How much gold do I have? 27. Is there a shop here? There is. Okay, I'll wait to go here and just until I go to the shop, just in case. Oh. Jeez, okay. Uh, cleansing. Can you cross wands over each other? You can. That's interesting. Um. The sword has still been useful. Um, let's see. Like that? Salamander. Yeah. This is a regen potion. Uh, 
I think we're good. Uh, I want to go to the store before I go to the other things. We do have a coal. Not useful for this, as uh, this can be used as many times as we want. Um, store. Okay. Hmm. It would be an extra four damage if we put it here. I guess it buffs up our sword right now as well. The six haze is kind of cool. <clears throat> but I'm happy with this. Let's go to the healer now. And we will take max HP. Let's go to this room. Free spin. Now, metallic wand... Ooh. I want that wand. Not enough gold. Unfortunate. For a shield, we don't have a shield, unfortunately, and we can't put it on a... Yeah. Unfortunate. I don't like the look of you. Oh, there's a King Cleaver. If only we were doing a Cleaver setup. Um... There's no reason not to go for the club over the sword. It's smaller, it does the same damage, uh, plus it adds weakness, it's just better. Save the event. Build is pretty strong so far. Perfect. Uh, each adjacent and diagonal structure. Think. And there's a key. Two keys, actually. I will take both keys. Ooh. Um. I will take that. At some point, we're gonna have to start getting rid of our ones for twos, but. Mirror shield. 
Remove spikes and rage from enemies. Hmm. That is actually really tempting. thinking Do we ditch a magical herb for it? Because against an enemy that has a lot of spike generations like potentially one of the final bosses that can be a big issue. Okay, just XP for that fight, basically. Other than this, um, just noticed that mana stone. Let's see. Is it time we ditch the club? We just ditch a melee weapon and go full on magic and hope to God we don't have to scratch our way out of things. <clears throat> okay. Okay. Uh, max HP? I don't think I want to start a fight with it yet. I have seen this before and I did not start a fight and I don't think I want to. One free spin, I guess. Don't land on a curse, please. So this was Splint. When adjacent weapon is used. Hmm. Do we get rid of... Does this count as armor? Hold on, let me just, for the... Very briefly, does this count as armor? No. Shield doesn't count as armor, only armor clothing counts as armor. So we could use it to heal us. So we're doing 6, 7, 8, 9, 10... 13 casts per combat, so 13 HP per combat. Hold on, let me rearrange all this. Brick wall, this goes here. Move all this. This goes here. This goes here. Mirror shield. This. Um, let's get rid of the spice. Okay. Healing is now covered. I'm not going to use my key here. Uh, just in case there's another level and I need a key for it. Uh, what do we have here? Oh, adds one dodge. Each combat adds one dodge. Um, hmm. This isn't being used on our weapon right now, either. Oh, and this stuff isn't connected, either, actually. That ain't gonna work.
Okay. Do we drop one of these 1-1 one, one mana stones for a magical herb? Hey, for my first ever magic run, I think this is not too bad. Okay, here's the boss for Enchanted Swamp. Let's see. Speaker. So, we have... Um, wow. Not great, actually. Guess we just take consumable healing. This doesn't heal us at all. Those are some shitty relics, that's for sure. Hmm. That's interesting. So this would give us two damage for this combat, but it costs one. There's no circumstance where this is good. Unless we have mana generation for the combat, there's no situation where this is good. But it is a legendary item. Which is something, I guess. The plus two haste, I don't really care about enough. I probably should care more about it, but... Okay, Magma Core? Yeah. Metallic wand. So right now this is 19 damage. If we put this in, let this calibrate, 20 damage. Okay, there we go. Easy peasy. It is a straight upgrade. Um, hasty fly. It's a rare item, which means it'll sell for five gold. So I'll just take it. Dragonfly is interesting, but we do that. Do we have a locked door here? No. Screw the key. Max health. Max health doesn't really matter because if we don't kill them in one turn. Uh, that's, that's game, basically.
more cleavers. One attacked, one haste to self. Uh, it is a rare, so I'll grab it to sell it. Do we have a store? No. Maybe we'll have a... Hopefully we have a store on the next floor. Ethereal Staff, it's conductive. can be used one time each turn. Creates a ethereal shiv in a space that is in this row. Just can't afford to take it. Once I do some selling and rearranging, I could do this. So I don't really care about the healing, huh? Uh, in this row, which means left to right. This is conductive, yeah. So that means it'll create it in this spot here. Oh, okay. I mean, there's no reason not to, I guess. Um, yeah, I guess. I only have four left. Am I really gonna have to scratch? Did have a commenter tell me how this rocket works. I think it's pretty bad still. This is a lifesaver. I'm gonna go max health again. You know, I should probably take the heal. Okay, floor eight. I think I like this better. Ooh, getting a little laggy, huh? It's on medium, uh... Ooh, very laggy. For some reason. Uh, let's do the math. We only have four uses left. Um, I'm gonna have to just use my magic herb.
fish sword I know is a very cool. This is not going to be a fun one. Um, I'm pretty sure we go for the queen bee first, just to make sure. Go for you last. Just to try and pull the spikes off of him. Uh, and then let's wait one turn. He's out of spikes now. Uh, this is gonna be bad, guys. Can't get him with scratches. It's not that this is going to be bad, it's just going to be slow. Oh my god. This guy might kill us. It's going to progressively get more and more damage every turn. Forty. It's going to be a rough one. He's going to start dealing damage to us now, and there's not going to be a whole lot we can do about it. I think we just die here because I didn't have enough mana. Yeah, 54 damage. I just don't have enough block for it. And we die. Man, this was uh this was a tough one. See, 
the the all or nothing like you have to win combat in a single round uh is pretty rough um because we die here man so yeah magic uh very strong but if you don't have the mana you just die uh which is very scary um very cool. Assuming that you get one of the rarer items, like one of the books. If you can get one of the books, I think this is a really, really strong run. But if you miss out on books, uh, you just don't have the mana to get through to a win, necessarily. Um, yeah. I guess that's that. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, consider subscribing. I'll catch you all for the next run.